السلام علیکم گائز اینڈ ویلکم ٹو مائی یوٹیوب چینل بایولوجی آرٹیکلز اینڈ ایم سی کیوز گائز اوور ٹو ڈیز ٹاپک از ڈائجیشن ان پلین ایریا فرسٹ آف آل وی ہیو ٹو ناؤ دیٹ وٹ از پلین ایریا سو پلین ایریا از اے فلیٹ ورم دیٹ از فاؤنڈ ان موسٹلی فریش واٹر اینڈ اٹ کین بی فاؤنڈ ان دا سالٹ واٹر انوائرمنٹ اینڈ دا فلیٹ ورم دا نیم شوز دیٹ اٹ از لائک دا بلون دیٹ از ود آؤٹ دا ایئر means you can say that it is like the deflated balloon and if we talk about that uh, the plain area which uh, things plain area feed upon then plain area is a carnivorous animal and uh, as a carnivorous name shows it uh, feed on the flesh and the, the flesh can be of the insect and larva or these can be annelids and mollusk so let's move towards the uh, digestive system of plain area that which um, which are the main parts of the digestive system so uh, the uh, digestive system of the plain area consists of a single gut opening means uh, there is a single opening that serves both as a mouth and the anus and that a single opening is present in the middle of the animal here you can see that there is a single opening that is called mouth and it will serve both as the mouth and the anus means for the inlet and outlet of the things then the mouth leads to a tube like structure that is called pharynx and then this pharynx will will lead to the intestine uh, there are main three branches of intestine present first is the there is the anterior one uh, that is extending towards the head uh, or you can say that it is extending forward and the second two branches are the lateral branches here you can see there is the first lateral bran branch of intestine and the second lateral branch of intestine that are extending towards the tail of the plain area so uh, there are the main these three portions first is the mouth the second is pharynx and the third is intestine Uh, in uh, addition to the intestine you can also see that there are the further small branches of the intestine are also present L here here you can see these are the small branches of intestine and these uh, small branches are and blindly means uh, these are further closed and these branches are called cecae so how these all uh, all these structures are helping in the uh, digestion of plain area let's move to, towards this portion first of all the in, uh, the plain area ingest the prey plain area will ingest the prey by protruding the pharynx it will not ingest the prey by the help of mouth it will produce its pharynx means it will move out its pharynx from the mouth uh, as uh, we can move out the trunk from our mouth then the plain area will uh, collect the food then uh, pharynx will uh, serve for the food collection uh, then uh, when the food will enter in this uh, pharynx uh, the pumping activity of the pharynx will break down the food first of all in the small pieces if uh, if the uh, that insect or that prey is in uh, uh, is a very large prey then uh, first of all the pumping action of the um, of that uh, pharynx is needed otherwise there is no need to break down the prey in addition to the pumping action of pharynx the pharynx also secretes some enzymes and the extra cellular digestion of that prey starts here then the food will pass into the intestine the food will pass both into the interior and uh, lateral branches of the intestine and the uh, and many cells like gland cells that are present in the intestine will digest the further mm, uh, will digest it further and this is all the extracellular digestion intracellular digestion is not started here then uh, finally the uh, particles after the extracellular digestion will go into in, inside the cells of uh, intestine and these cells are mainly phagocytic cells when the food will enter into the phagocytic cells the phagocytic cells will, will then starting the digesting the food further and this is now the intracellular digestion 
Here the digestion is completed. Firstly, the extracellular digestion is carried out in the pharynx and intestine, and the intracellular digestion is carried down uh, out in the phagocytic cells of the intestine. Now the particles are completely digested and are now ready to be absorbed. And these uh, will absorb into the body cells of the intestine by the help of a process which is called diffusion. Means uh, the um, uh, the particles will move from their high concentration to the low concentration and will be absorbed in the body cells of in um, body cells of planaria. Uh, and uh, then in, uh, the planaria will only absorb uh, those uh, particles which are needed by the body of planaria and then the undigested waste will be egested means it will go out of um, from the body of the planaria from the um, uh, from the single opening that was mouth because there is no special uh, type of opening uh, like anus is present in, uh, in plain area. So the mouth will help in the ingestion of, plain, uh, of food from the body of plain area. This is how all the digestion is carried out in the body of plain area. I hope you all understand all the concepts about the digestion. And if you like this video, share this video with your friends. Thank you so much.